Hi, I'm Tony from Archaos. Hi, this is uh, Tony from Archaos, and uh, today we're going to talk about a new feature in Grand VJ 2.5, which is the merger. All right, um, I made a little setup in our demo room uh, just to show you this. And uh, first of all, I will s explain the setup. So, what did I do? Uh, first, I took some Klingnet. Um, and in Klingnet, uh, as you know, if you open the Klingnet mapper, it will scan your products that you have. And once detected, you can drag and drop them onto your canvas and map them. You see that my mapping is a bit messy, but uh, that is because I wanted to do it quick and dirty and so just have some lights blinking for this purpose of this demo. So uh, what did I put there? I put um, uh, some uh, pixel uh, devices, some uh, pixel strips. Uh, I also put a spider from Ruby and I have some uh, 4x4s from Chauvet here. So uh, those are all Klingnet devices and uh, once you uh, map them uh, onto your canvas and you then launch the visual as I uh, did here, you see that they all start blinking. So there, nothing special, nothing changed. That was already like this in the first one. Um, thing that uh, I show now here is also that you see the Klingforce LEDs. We made some uh, we made some boards just to test our devices, uh, and you see them now also blinking. So that's all Klingnet. But then we go to the LED mapper, and there is something new in the LED mapper, and that is the the merger. So when I'm open the LED mapper, you will see here that I did uh, some mapping of uh, Elation ACL devices and some uh, pixel bars uh, that are also mapped in the LED mapper. But what is new is here is the merger, so it's activated. And what does the merger do? It takes everything Artnet and DMX from uh, one universe uh, or from a universe, so you set uh, the starts, uh, which subnet you start, which universe you start, so we start here at universe 2. Since it's a small setup, we only use one universe, so consecutive universes 1, and we merge that to uh, universe 10. So, and then we put the devices uh, that are listening to it to universe 10. And why is that? Then we can use a movement from uh, a DMX controller, uh, a lighting desk like uh, Grantame or Camsys, uh, we use Camsys in this case. And uh, so the movement comes from there and light can also come from there, but you can also choose to have the light from uh, Grand VJ, which makes some cool effects. Okay, let's close it down. So the merger new here. So let's put this back to Grand VJ. Close this down. Close it down. There we go. And if you then see uh, everything is blinking, uh, the LED bars are blinking and the uh, ACLs are blinking. So uh, now I can also launch movement uh, from the uh, DMX controller and you will see that the lights move, but uh, so the moving it's move, but the light is still coming from Grand VJ, um, uh, which means that um, I can change the light any way I want. Uh, as you can see here, I can put this on, I can uh, change it to this and then you will see that this all changes in real time on all devices. So that is pretty cool. Um, one thing uh, worth mentioning is that in the preference file, in the display where you launch Klingnet and the LED mapper, you will now here have some extra uh, controls, which are the merge mode. You can put it in replace, but you can also do all these modes, uh, maximum mode, minimum mode. So uh, different ways of uh, combining the light from the desk with the light from uh, Grand VJ. And here you say the merge intensity. So 100% means 100% is coming from Grand VJ. If you put it to zero, of course, uh, it's coming 100% for from the desk, and you can uh, mix him in between. Um, these uh, controls are also uh, mappable through MIDI, so you can MIDI map them. Uh, so if you go to options, edit MIDI mapping, uh, 
you will find them here in the master control you will see here the merge mode that you can select and then uh, do the MIDI learning to uh, learn that MIDI to map it and the merger intensity so those two things I showed earlier in the menu can be MIDI mapped so on your MIDI controller you can then uh, choose which uh, mode you use and which intensity so there you go new feature in Grand VJ 2.5